I am back with a brand new review. You've been asking me to review, to test, to try the TLM Foundation Colour Changing. It's all day flawless lift from, no, 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 it's all day flawless lit from within complexion. Perfectly flawless finish, SPF 15. Foundation colour changing and adjusting naked. That's not even a sentence, is it? An adjusting naked. What is it adjusting? What is it nakedly adjusting? Okay, so foundation with core resistium technology. What you do is you whack it on your face, right? And when you start blending it in, the colour appears. So rather than doing it before my holidays, I've come back from that there Lanzagrotti and I thought I'll have a bit of a tan. Let's see if it does what it says on box because it says it adjusts to all colours. So, the foundation with core resistant, blah, blah, blah. It also fights, it fights the signs of a makeup meltdown. Very good. Created for the very latest high definition technology. What it says as well is it's got an advanced formula and it's invisible on 4K camera and to the naked eye. Oh, is that what that thing adjusting naked? I don't know. Perfect the makeup pros and for you. Feels like a second skin, but still provides medium coverage. Light diffusing formula, blah, blah, fucking blah. Great for all skin types and features a full range of shades to cover skin tones. Um, let's get it out of the box, shall we? How have you all been anyway? Put my mini mouse head band on. I will put some details in the link above for this product we're reviewing and for headband because when I do videos, I've noticed people are now saying, where's your headband from? Where's your t-shirt from? Where's that picture from in background? Where's your bedding from? Where are you from? I'm from Italia. Okay, so trolls before you start. I don't think I'm Minnie Mouse. It's just a fucking headband. Give it a shake. I don't know why I'm shaking. It doesn't say to. So that's what it looks like. So it's not offensive. It is cheap as chips, but it makes me slightly worried. Get it up back in me hand. <laughs> oh, not exactly the white stuff I like to be covered in. <clears throat> Fuck a duck. It's Fucking hell, not exactly pump action, is it? Is it open? How is it open to get stuff out? Ooh. Oh, <laughs> okay. So, looks like Tipex. I've got rhinitis, I can't really smell it. It does say fragrance free, but there's a bit of something going on there. I'm not sure what. So what we're going to do firstly is, before we whack it on our face, We've got a little bit on our hand, can we see, with my new tripod and my new light. Jemima, I've called her. I'm going to start rubbing that in, in my hand, and seeing if it fucking happens. Oh, can you see? It goes like um, a bit, a bit creamy coloured. It is definitely creamy coloured, isn't it? So, you can tell I've got some of on my hands there, so that's not blended in just yet. But, we're not really here to do it on our hands, are we? Just like to get a bit of a, a whack. Leave that on for a minute. Let's get it on our face. Because that's where you'd normally put foundation. Oh. oh, for fuck's sake, I'm not interested in this. This is not good. Right, so it won't do pump action. But, will it cover my fucking face? That I often apologise for. Get a foundation brush today. I'm going to be using this one, which has been specially made for me. It says uncensored. <laughs> That'll be me. Right, let's go. Are we ready? Ready. Contenders ready. Right, so let's get that blended in. Oh, 
Oh, fuck it. I can't be asked. Oh, changing colour at brush. So something's happening. Let's have a look. I haven't put a lot on. I haven't. Looks like I have, but I haven't. And still stayed a bit creamy. It's not blending in right well. I'll be honest, it's not sinking in beautifully. It's not. Um, let's have a look. Right, so everybody knows I don't normally use a foundation brush, do I? I don't. Is you wax stuff on my hands, go like that and whack it on. So let's do that and see what happens. Because apparently it's got this right good technology in it. And um, that's what makes it colour changing. I don't like it. It's took me fucking tan off. It's made me look like a fucking geisha girl. And it. That's not worked. No wonder it's only fucking £2.88. It's not worked. That That's not going to work, is it? That does not work. Look. That's my hand, like that. And then that's my face. And I'm using my brand new light as well, which is like, well, good. <sighs> it is foundation colour, look. It has got some colour, but that's not the colour I'd fucking go for. So you've asked me to review it. I've reviewed it. Does it change colour? Yes, it does. Does it adjust to your own skin tone? Does it fuck? All the details for what I've reviewed today, what I've got with my fucking head, will be in the link above. Thanks for watching. If you've liked it, give it a like. If you've loved it, give it a love. Share it with your friends. If you're watching me on Twitter, comment down below. And the link will be down below. If it's on Facebook, everything's up there. Take care, flower pots, and I'll see you all soon. With my normal skin colour and a new review.